Hi, in this version of Watkins Waggles you'll see we've got all high tech, we now have an electronic intro slide and this video is going to talk to you about covalent bonding, particularly use of the mnemonic caring, sharing, coconuts and what that means. Caring, sharing, coconuts. Why should we be thinking about coconuts when we're thinking about covalent bonding? The first thing to think about is that coconuts start with the same beginning as the word covalent. Quite a lot of you accidentally call it convalent. There is no N in that word, it is definitely covalent, like coconuts, covalent. That's the first thing. Get the name right, make sure you can spell it. Coconuts are also made of non-metals, as are covalently bonded substances. So think about a coconut, definitely not made of a metal, covalent substances, non-metal elements together. Sharing. Why caring sharing coconuts? Because in terms of electrons, covalent bonds are a shared pair of electrons. So if that's what they ask you for, if they ask you to describe a covalent bond in terms of electrons, this word in terms of means talk about. Talk about what is happening to the electrons. They're shared. But it's a pair of electrons, two of them, that are shared to make one covalent bond. Coconuts are also circular. Not strictly a circle, obviously mathematically they are a sphere, but because they're circular, that helps us to remember that the covalent bonding diagrams are always circles. There's one there at the bottom, overlapping circles, and you can see in the circles you've got a red dot and a blue cross, representing a shared pair of electrons. I'm now going to talk you through how to make sure, one, you don't miss out on these covalent bonding diagrams, and two, you make sure that when you do see them, you get every single one of them perfectly correct.